when Razo and Nitro ended, and he was letting me know that uh, he definitely had a winning record over Razo in the previous season. I see, okay. And if he continues playing the way he was playing at EVO, I can only see him extending that lead even further. Yeah, that's right. Master Mario having a crazy run at EVO, doing super well. When did, what did he end up placing? I believe he placed 33rd. 33rd, okay. Yeah. So that's out of 3,500 plus entries. That's a lot of people. That's a lot of people. That means he placed in the top percent. Yes, yes. Uh, Master Mario has just been on the rise for a while now, I think. Uh, he, he wasn't even PR'd maybe a year or so again, but now he's he's uh, doing some great things with Mario. Yeah, I mean, he's definitely a player who started out in Smash 4. He didn't exactly have, um, you know, he, he didn't have, uh, I would say, the best training ground. But he just continued to keep at it. He continued to work. And now, as you can see, he's having a great start here. Game one of Winner's Finals. But Razo, you know, he's a player who also, very similar to Master Mario, worked really hard to get where he's at. Yeah, that's right. Um, man, these Mario combos are uh, super strong. We're seeing Master Mario take a commanding lead here. Um, but Razo is a strong player, obviously. We can count him out, and he's sort of managed to build up some momentum back here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But yeah, Mario just getting in and he can just walk over you with this frame data. Uh, Peach is, is, is super fast, but she needs to be close to the ground to get all those flow cancels off. I mean, the flow cancel is definitely a tool that we're going to see Razo trying to abuse. But falling Nair, especially with Nair lasting so long, is a great approaching tool for Master Mario. We're going to see him abuse that as well. But right. catching a jump from the ledge with Fair. Nice. And uh, yeah, that weak hitbox uh, combo is uh, uh, Mario's Nair, of course, into so many things. <laughs> wow. Just called out that air dodge with a S smash. Mm -hmm. That's probably one of the, the weaknesses that comes with using so many flow cancels or just that kind of not really getting too much height from the actual ground is that those grounded moves, especially those smash attacks, are still going to work even though you're in the air. But, oh, a couple up airs into an up B, and that's going to be a good amount of damage. Even using the Flood to push back Razo. Yeah, that Flood, uh, sometimes it doesn't really seem like it's it's doing a lot, but for positioning's sake, it's it's it can be super useful. Yeah, it even, like, just forces your opponent to expend more resources and just to see what they'll do in that disadvantage state, or even just take stage control. Double back air, and that's going to put Razo off stage, another back air. Ooh, oh, but whipping the forward air. That would have been so cool. I, I wonder if that's even possible to c connect that back air into, into uh, forward air. This is Mario. He can connect anything into anything. anything. Is possible. <laughs> Custom combos all day, er day. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it must be nice just being able to land a button and saying, what move do I want to connect next? Do I want to go into an up tilt? Do I want to... Let me just reset on the ground, go for more up airs, and then finish with this style forward air. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that sounds good. I'm going to do that. Just, no, I mean, I guess maybe the same <laughs> way that Hero Roulette hits up. Uh, uh, hits maybe uh, Master Mario's thinking the same way. Although, mm -hmm. I think he's more optimized with his combo. He knows exactly what he's going for, and he's going for that kill. Oh, for sure. I mean, he definitely subscribes to the school of Dark Wizzy when it comes to, like, these combos. But, ooh, a couple of nares into an F smash, and Rosal's going to go up uh, first on this board of percent. Okay, that was really interesting. Did you see Master Mario tilted his shield up, but it still didn't really poke uh, that down smash? Okay, fireball. Now we're seeing, a, one thing I'm noticing from Master Mario is I'm seeing a lot less fireball approaches. We used, used to see uh, Master Mario like short hopping and full hopping and fireball, and then running behind the fireball to uh, really approach with it, causing pressure, forcing his opponents into shield and getting a grab, or even for them to respect it, and then just really challenging whatever option they choose after that. Okay. I like what I'm seeing with the uh with Master Mario just sort of angling his shield, it, I, I don't really know what he's trying to accomplish. Uh, oh, maybe it looks like he just wants to up the amount of shield, actually. But I've seen him, he was also uh, angling it forward a little bit, trying to maybe catch uh, some of Peach's aerials. 
All right. That's Mario going to chase him off stage with that back air. And you see that down air connecting, but sending Master Mario to the left instead of the direction Raza was expecting. Now Master Mario with the ledge traps. Oh, going for a full hop. Yeah, that cross up back air isn't going to connect. And now we see the DBZ with this uh, final destination transformation, not going to give Razo any platforms to retreat to. Thus, the up smash. Up smash. Uh, still a great move. <laughs> oh, for sure. I mean, they may have changed a, a few things from from Mario from Smash 4 to Smash Ultimate, but that up smash is still still the uh, the golden touch. The golden touch. I thought you were going to say goat there for a second. The goat? No, that, that move is not the goat. <laughs> that move, anything but the goat. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> Oh, okay. okay. That, those up airs, that, that's the goat right there. Yeah. Falling up, the fact that falling up air to forward air still works, you can still combo falling up air is a godsend for Mario. Yeah, and I mean, we saw, oh wow, okay, another, so he, Razo calling out that jump. <laughs> and um, getting that kill. Mm -hmm. Okay, Razo going for the uh, the back air into into turn around down tilt, but he messes up a little bit. He's still going to get a combo here with oh. huge damage and calls out that air dodge. It almost gets even more, but messes up with the dash grab there. And that was just great coverage options coming from Razo. He got the back air and he's just started to drift back to the platform just to reset his jumps. And he, Master Mario just happened to fall into his lap and said, "You know what? I'll take another back air." But just like falling into his lap. Razo fell into Master Mario's up smash, and we have even stocks in game two. And ho oh, oh, ho, you see that fireball get stuffed out? Oh, yeah. And yeah, Master Mario making this look like Smash 4 again with all those up smash kills. Okay, retreating back to neutral. And there's that fireball approach that I was mentioning earlier. Starting to see it come out a little bit more, but a back air into down air does connect. Back yeah. air going to put Master Mario off stage. Maybe he's just uh, saving it for these last stocks to just kind of keep his opponents off balance oh. at the time he needs it most. Oh. oh! That's so unfortunate, just pushing the wrong button, keeping Razo in an animation. Master Mario even had enough time to charge that S smash a little bit just to secure yeah. the kill. I, I think that would have killed regardless, but you got to charge on your boy. you got to send a message. That's right. You, not only do you got to send a message, but you got to put a, add, add a little bit of extra insurance on that. You never know when big stages like that's true. Like that's town true. and city, the Blast Zones might just come in clutch for your opponent. You know what? Let's just, let's just take that factor away. Just, yeah, give it let a little me, more let juice. Me give me this game, too. I earned it. Okay, so going into game three, no character switches, but no surprises there. Yeah, and we're seeing Master Mario come out swinging. Will he ta make this a 3-0? I don't know, guys. Certainly possible. Anything is possible. Yeah, falling down there. What okay, was that Rast air dodge? Oh, oh, and he's gonna die for it. This is looking like Master Mario's game. Yeah, very also, unfortunate. You know, in the spirit of competition, I was, you know, you always hate to see these SDs. Yes, we do take those, but even as uh, Razo kind of fell to the blast zone, Master Mario was shaking his head and he had a sour look in his face like, you know, this is not how you want to win. Come on, Master Mario, where's the homie stuff? I mean, <laughs> like I said, we do take those. <laughs> yeah, we do take those. <laughs> like, I ain't happy about it, but I'm going to I'm gonna take it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I mean, you want to win. I think, especially Master Mario, I think he's come so far and, he, and he's put a lot of... Uh, uh, effort and to mm -hmm. get where he wants to be. So yes, we will take those for sure. And that's definitely going to help him when it comes to the next uh, SoCal PR. His placement should be uh, significantly higher than what it was in this one. <laughs> oh Falling there God. into F smash. <laughs> Almighty equalizer. Of, of um, just a, a lasting Nair. Yeah, Mario's a character that you can just get really creative with these combos, like you said. You know, Nair into what am I feeling like today? Look at this. Razo was just standing at the ledge, being very patient, and that's Mario was flying all over the stage. Yeah. Okay. Razo is definitely slowing his tempo down. He's trying to bait out some type of out of shield option. But again, Talon City is huge. He's, that's not going to kill him. Oh, like that. Give me my space. Okay, side B. An interesting option there. Very risky. Uh, it was interesting to see, like, those risky options come out when you're when the players are down you know, so much. 
but sometimes you just got to put it all on the line. You don't have a lot to lose at this point. Yeah, sometimes you got to make a play, especially when your opponent is content with the lead and they are not approaching. It falls on you to really force some type of action, oh, nice but double turn guard. up. Sniping the turn ups. Eat your vegetables, Mario. I mean, that's the type of play that, that Razo needed to make. Radishes are spicy, I'm getting confused. <laughs> okay, so Razo continuing to play patient. Uh, I think maybe he's, he's thinking that uh, he was a little playing a little too fast earlier and... Oh, but he's still living. Great DI yeah, okay. on that wow, down yeah, air. He still lives. 134%, probably not gonna live that one though. 3-0 oh, Master three Mario. Oh, dirty 30. I wonder what, it, what is his thing stand for? Mario! Master! 30-30, man. So Master Mario sitting in winner or sitting in finals on the winner's side. We're gonna get it. 